Hey, what's going on? So somebody had a question about adjusting the links in the footer, the footer menu items, how you can adjust the height of the link. So I'm gonna show you how you can do that in this video. Break that down is very simple. So what you wanna do is come to your theme customizer and then you wanna to go to the footer. So you can just click on the footer. So we on your theme, just click to the footer like this. Your footer should come up. Next thing that you wanna do is you wanna come down here to where it says custom CSS. This is where you're gonna add the code that's gonna be able to adjust the footer height. What you wanna do is you wanna come and you wanna paste in this code. All you wanna do is you wanna type in LI. Now, if you're talking about these links right here, which is what that person was referring to, these are called list items. You can think of them like this is a list and then there's items in that list. So the LI just represents list item. Here we're saying that the height wanted to be 37 pixels. So you can always adjust the height to a number that meets your needs. So let's say, <coughs> excuse me. So the 37, let's say it's too high. Let's put it at 25. Okay, now you see it's smaller. So now for some reason, let's say still too big, need a smaller, put it at 20. You see now it's close. Now let's say, okay, this is way too small. I need a bigger. Let's put it at 50. You see it's spread out. So all you have to do, Go to your section, type in, or go to custom CSS, type in LI with the bracket, put height, adjust the number to a number that meets your needs, close that bracket. And this is how you can adjust the height of your footer links on your Shopify store. So if you need help implementing this on your store, if you still have any other questions, please feel free to reach out. I'd be glad to help you out to add this to your store and to get this set up for you. And once again, I hope this video was helpful. And please feel free to reach out if you have any other questions or you'd like to implement it on your store.